Hello, my friends. This is Ana Sarabia. I hope today you are having a great day. And today I wanted to talk about what is it like to be a real estate agent? I don't think that I've ever talked about this because I have never considered the possibility of uh, growing a team, you know, with more people, both in the listing and the buying side. You know, we're a very tight group as far as, you know, what, what we run. Um, but I have decided that after 22 years and all the coaching and all the training and all the different courses and just being exposed to the business for this long, it would be a shame not to pass it on to new agents, you know, new people that are trying to discover what real estate is about. So in, in, in order to start doing that first, you know, I want to talk about the misconception of real estate. There's a lot of people out there uh, that sees a real estate agent driving a fancy car, you know, living in a big house, things like that. And then there's this perception that every single agent or every single person that does real estate does it at a very high level. And that is simply not the case. It is a well-known fact that the average agent with 10 years of experience sells four to six homes a year. So that's probably a great when your sales price is, I don't know, at a minimum five, 600,000. But in other markets where you have the 200, the 300, it's really hard to make a living by just selling four houses a year. So that's the first misconception that this is such an easy and a very sexy <laughs> profession. And it's nothing but. The reality is that once you are done selling to your friends and family when you first start, the rest is just hard work. And it is very true that there are some things that can make the life of a real estate agent easier. For instance, if you work in the place where you grew up, you know, chances are, you know, your friends, it'll come a point when, you know, they'll start getting married, needing homes or your family, everybody lives in the same town. So yes, there is a pretty good possibility that you know a lot of people. And that is the biggest, you know, treasure that you can have, which is your database, the people that you know and that know you and that have, you don't have to, you know, sell yourself to them because they will work with you automatically. However, when you're coming from another city or you don't know anybody there, you don't have any friends or family, again, that is hard work. And that is where a lot of agents, you know, seem to fail because this is not, you know, easy to, to do prospecting. That is the magic word, prospecting. And what is prospecting? It's basically, it involves cold calling, door knocking, you know, going to functions, meeting people so that you can start creating a database. So I'm going to start creating, you know, this, this um, series for those who are considering a career in real estate. And if you are, if you want to come join us, you know, because we definitely have developed a way, a system um, to be able to share with you that gives you the tools that you need to succeed in this business. If you are aware, conscious, and you have the dedication, uh, the integrity, you know, to do this at a very high level. So stay tuned. Uh, we will be talking about this at length. If you have any questions, if you have ever considered, you know, the possibility of a career change or you're a young person who's trying, you know, to find a good fit that will definitely provide you with a great lifestyle if you put the work, just like with everything else. I mean, you put the work and the results are directly proportional to the effort that you put on it. So I would love to share, you know, my journey with you, how my days, you know, look like after 22 years of doing this. What I have to say is the passion I have for it. Every day I wake up with the same intention, uh, clarity of, you know, finding people, having something to say, uh, and have enough people to say it to. And um, we'll go over all those things. But for now, I just wanted to leave you with that. And I look the forward the opportunity. Again, if you're considering this or would like to, you know, get a, a, a more idea, a realistic idea, not a dream, rah, rah idea, but a really, you know, clear, cold, factual uh, introduction to real estate. Thank you so much for watching. Always have to ask you this. If you like this content, please give us a thumbs up.
subscribe to our channel. And again, thank you so much for giving me some of your time.